Okay, I'd like to do one more example of an amortization schedule. Uh, for a mortgage, the amortization schedule would be too long to work out in the entirety of the loan. And so we'll just do the first three months. And we'll suppose that the original amount was 120000 and the interest rate is 7% per year. And of course we could use these figures to calculate the payment as we did at the start of this section. But that's not the purpose of this example. We're going to use the payment information, $798.37, to prepare the amortization schedule. Okay, so in this case, I is not going to be a nice round figure. It's going to be 7% divided by 12. Uh, on the other hand, when we multiply this by the uh, original amount of the loan, then it, uh, it does come out to a nice round figure of $700. Okay, so that's the interest that we owe after one month. We make a payment, $798.37. Most of that payment is going to go to pay the interest, $700. But there is $98.37 left over to reduce the loan balance. Okay, so that gets subtracted from $120,000. And our new loan balance is $119,901.63. Okay, so now we repeat the process. Okay, so we have that 119, 901.63, and we have to multiply that by 7% and divide by 12. And that gives us $699.43. Okay, so that's on the second line of our schedule. Okay, we make a payment, $798.37. First thing that comes out of that payment is the interest, $699.43. And then we also have left over $98.94, which is used to reduce the loan balance. Okay, so after two months, we owe $119,802.69. Okay, we repeat the process for a third month. You can see the interest is going down gradually each month and the amount of the principal that we repay increases gradually each month. And so there's the amortization schedule for this loan after three months.